Hello, it's John Burford with Chart of the Week for Monday the 17th of February and today I'm covering Hammerson, uh, a major UK um, shopping centre owner and it's in the, uh, <laughs> the dreaded uh, uh, retail sector of the market and uh, we all know it's no secret that it's, um, it's had pretty much a hammering in recent years and the share price has followed that sentiment. So let's go back to um, uh, the, the high here of £7 in 2015. It's been on a pretty much uh, steady downhill escalator, certainly since the, uh, the high here of 2018, uh, pretty much straight down. Uh, and it made a low here of £2 in August of last year. That's a loss of 72% off the high. Um, that's, uh, that's a pretty big hit for investors to take. But notice the momentum divergence down here. Um, it's positive. And that usually heralds a, a reversal of some sort. And that's exactly what we got. A pretty sharp reversal from £2 to £3 something. So that's a better than 50% 50, 50 gain. That's uh, well worth going for if you're a swing trader. But since then, it's been coming back down here. And I believe this uh, has a very good chance of being um, a major low for the shares. And I'll explain that in the daily chart. Um, but basically what I'm doing here is laying out a case for uh, a bull, um, a bull um, a position in Hammerson. All right, here's the daily chart. That's the latest slide down here. This is a big gap. That's well worth keeping an eye on because gaps usually get filled, sometimes weeks, sometimes months later, but uh, they get filled pretty much uh, every time, unless the share is uh, headed for bankruptcy, of course, uh, when the price goes to zero. But anyway, here's the, um, here's the August £2 low here. And notice the rally is in five waves. One, two, long and strong, three, four, five. So that top here is either wave one high or an A wave high. And since then, we've had a three wave uh, decline. One, two, three. And that is also on a very large momentum divergence. Now, odds are now swinging very rapidly to a substantial rally phase and I think this will be my first uh, target around the three three pound twenty area, and of course this gap here is another one of my targets. So let's compare Hammerson with Into, a, a rival property owner. Uh, this is um, the 2015 high, the same time that Hammerson made its high. But since then, the shape of the chart is completely different. We've got an accelerating downtrend in an exponential shape. And uh, the recent price is, is 12 pence, and it was 360 up here. So that's a loss of 97%. That is headed for the uh, bankruptcy courts, uh, I, uh, I believe. Uh, it could have a last-minute reprieve, but um, I'm pretty sure that the shares will be worthless pretty soon. But notice uh, here, we've got momentum divergences. Here's a little lesson in how not to use momentum divergences. <laughs> this is a big one here, but the market made a low, but it only made a very tiny, tiniest of rallies. This is the same time that Hammerson made a 50% rally, uh, but then it's, it's, it slid down here to the 12 pence area, also on a momentum divergence, uh, so that they were definitely not buy signals. To get a buy signal, I need more than a momentum divergence. So here we are, back to Hammerson on the daily chart. I think this uh, area here has a very uh, strong of being a major low, and I'm looking for a bull move in Hammerson.